Hello everybody, Basilisk Fang here, and welcome back to Near Replicant. We are in the absolutely beautiful city of Seafront. In fact, this kind of city makes it seem like there's nothing going wrong in the world at all, compared to my village where everything seems to be going wrong all the time. We have just received a fishing rod and a lure, and we need to go and catch a shaman fish. Problem is, I don't actually know how to fish. First of all, what's this? A shell. I don't have one of those. I'm pretty sure the guy said something about going to the beach over here to actually catch shaman fish. You can't catch them from the pier. And I'm familiar with this area. I've been over here already. There's dolphins, there's seals, there's cultish children. I just need to know how to fish. Oh, there's a handy little, you know, indicator in the upper right. Press B to fish. All right. Uh, lure. And how does this work? Do I just press the button to reel it in? This is exciting. Oop, we got something. How do I... I don't know how to... Did that work? Did I do it? The fish got away. All right, well, I don't know how to fish. When the fishing pole makes a large movement, you need to move your body as well. Oh, that vaguely sounds familiar. It'd be nice if there was like an actual, you know, fishing tutorial. They keep giving me tutorials that I don't actually need, and then they don't give me a fishing tutorial. Oop, there it goes. So I pull. I see. So I pull the opposite direction. Okay, I think. I think I'm doing it right. Maybe? Okay, then he goes back that way and I pull the other way. Maybe? I don't... I don't know what I'm doing. When the bar runs out, does that mean I've caught the fish? Yes? Yes. Okay. That's not a very fine-tuned fishing game. But I did get a shaman fish, so that's good. And I broke my record of not having a record. We're all set. Let's get this back to Yona. All right, I know people like fishing mini games in games, and in your Automata, it was you know, it was okay. But in this, I'm so far not impressed. I mean, in your Automata, it was super easy. It was wait for the thing to drop, and then, oh, hey, it's the lighthouse lady. So tired. Anyway, in your Automata, it was you know wait for the bobber to drop, but the bobber being the pod, and then just press the A button and you'd reel it in. Uh, and this, there's like actual like f f weird mechanics. Anyway. Hello, lady. What can I do for you? Nothing. Hold it. All right. Yeah, I tried talking to you, and now, all right, whatever. I said, hold it over here. All right. Jeez, bossy pants. How can you just ignore an old woman in need? Oh, I weep for this generation. Again, I tried to help you, and you wouldn't talk to me. Children of this age are nothing but selfish, Oh yeah, that's how you get people to help you. Uh, are you talking about me? Oh, ignore her. We've a quest to complete. People like that are best left to their own devices. Oh, 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 <laughs> that's uh, like some great A voice acting. What's wrong? Is everything okay? My illness has returned. It must have been the shock of seeing this rude, lonely book. He is kind of rude sometimes. Rude? Book? Now, see here, madam. I'll have you know. You? You did this? Oh, what a terrible thing you are. Why, you insolent crone? How dare you address me like some common paperback? Yeah, paperbacks are inferior. Vice, knock it off. You there, would you truly abandon a pitiful old woman to this cruel world? I mean, I'll abandon a rude one. Are you asking me? Oh, do please ask me. Well, we should probably help the old lady. I can't imagine we'll lose anything by helping her, except for maybe I our dignity. Help you, ma'am. Oh, good heavens. I can't believe how much cajoling that took. Our apologies, ma'am. I am at a loss as to what aid we could possibly give a woman who is so clearly able to talk her way into anything. I need you to go to the post office and tell them to deliver my mail. I can't fathom why they haven't been here yet. Oh, 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 oh the pain! Okay, okay, we're going. Look at us go! <laughs> Alright, well, uh, good thing I know where the post office is. At least I think I do. This town's a bit of a maze. I know the post office is by the fountain, which is over here. All right. All right, I'm figuring it out. I'm figuring out the layout of the town. Oh, the postman's gone. There was a postman standing outside of here. 
Hey, can you deliver the old lady's mail? Hey, so there's some old lady who yelled at us to come here and check on her mail and... Oh, you mean the lighthouse lady? The very same. Now could you please deliver her parcels and silence her flapping gums? Sorry, but I injured my leg. I won't be delivering anything for a while. I'm sorry, I didn't realize you were the only postman. Oh, that's too bad. Maybe we can... A hurt leg? What about your sacred postman's oath? Neither wind nor sleet nor terrible monsters of the night shall keep thee from... Hey, if your leg hurts, we'll just deliver it for you. Seems a lot easier than whatever the book's trying to do. Uh, oh, that would be a huge help. Uh, just be careful, alright? That lady has a bit of a temper. Is this gonna be another oh, fragile sure. package quest? Ah, oh, it's just a letter. Pretty hard to break a letter. And then I can apparently view letters, but I feel like I shouldn't be opening her mail. So I'm not going to. You know, since you're here... Oh, what is it now? You're from Popola's village, right? The very same. Yeah. How do you know? Huh? Well, you're dressed differently, and you just have a certain air about you, I guess. Are you calling me smelly? Anyway, would you mind taking this letter to Popola when you go back? Sure. Again, where is the other postman? There was one standing outside. There's at least one other able-bodied postman. Uh, we might as well take the postman's oath ourselves. And take the postman's pay? Because, you know, postmen are so rich. All right, let's go shut up this old lady and then get back to Yona. Are you still standing here or do I have to walk it all the way up to the lighthouse? Oh, great. I don't hear the crone, and I'm sure I would if she were here. They call her the lighthouse lady, right? Well, let's go check the lighthouse. I was already at the lighthouse. This is what I get for exploring everything and then doing the story. What an absurd waste of time this is. I'm starting to agree with the grimoire on this one. Go up this weird 2D side-scrolling mechanic of a staircase that I don't fully understand. Wait, hold on. What does that book say? Zoom and enhance. Does it say im over a nude all? Or ale? I don't know. It clearly has English letters on it. Well, Romanized letters. They're not just English letters. Oh, I see you managed to get all the way up here in the few seconds it took me to run to the post office. I didn't English that very good, but you understand what I mean. Um... Oh. You. What do you want? What, is, what do you mean? We have retrieved your letter. The postman hurt his leg. That's why he... That's no excuse. It's his job to deliver the mail no matter what. Didn't he take the postman's oath? I mean, I kind of agree with you. The thought that anyone would actually bother to write you a letter staggers the imagination. Such a rude book. I'll have you know this is from someone very dear to me. Well, I suppose I should give you something for your trouble. Yeah, a thousand gold. That's okay. That's okay for a quick quest. And we're done here? Alright, I'm leaving. I ain't hanging out. I ain't talking to her. I don't want to know her story. There is a part of me that wants to see if there's any, like, side quests that unlocked around here just to add them to my list. I don't think these children are going to have anything for me. Yes, no, maybe. Nope, nothing from the children. Alright, let's go check the town really quick, but then we'll go back and see Yona. Oh boy, the guy on the pier wants to talk to me. What's up, dude? So, you ain't caught the fish, did you? Yeah, barely. Well, since you're so insistent, I suppose I better reveal one of my fishing secrets. Uh, sure? I, apparently it's a quest. Uh, was I being insistent? Enough. If you catch ten sardines, I'll reveal one of my most closely guarded secrets. Yeah, that's not high on my list of things to do. Okay, so I broke some boxes and found a couple of fishing tips, so let's see if these are actually useful. Different baits can cause different fish to bite, even if you're fishing in the same spot. Alright, that seems like it would have been obvious. Completing certain quests will raise your fishing skill, make it easier to catch larger fish. Okay. I'm guessing that means if I complete, like, his sardine quest or whatever. Which would be nice, however, I don't plan on spending more time fishing than I absolutely need. Oh, there's a tavern here! I didn't even realize there was a tavern here. Hello! Ah, you have a quest for me. Apparently all the bartenders have quests. Hey Any specials on the menu today? Well, we have a local special, but lately I've had trouble getting the ingredients. It's pretty much all anyone here wants to eat. So if we don't secure a better supply, our business is gonna go under. Well, that's terrible. Want me to find the ingredients? Would you? Oh, thank you so much. I need ten medicinal herbs, 
10 bags of wheat, and 10 sardines. If you can find all that, I'll make it worth your while. Uh, that's a lot. Well, whenever I catch the 10 sardines for the one guy, I'll, I'll talk to you. Medicinal herbs are easy. Not really sure where to find bags of wheat. But oh well, at least we unlocked the quest. Who would have thunk it? Somebody on the boat has a quest for me. What can I do for you? I still don't have enough inventory. What's the problem? Well, I'm trying to get into the trading business, so I'm stocking up on the essentials. You mean like selling local products to faraway lands? Uh, not products so much as raw materials. With every nation running out of the basics, I figure it's a great way to make a killing. But right now, I don't have a source for materials. And it's driving me crazy. Sounds like a very, very basic problem. If I could make just one transaction, I could get this thing off the ground. But I don't have anything to offer. It's a real, what you call it, conundrum. I wouldn't mind getting some materials for you to sell. Oh, Lord. Seriously? Well, that would be great. Yeah, and you're going to pay me for these materials how? What do you need? That's a pretty big list, so you might want to write it down in that floating notebook of yours. Okay, let's see. I need ten bundles of wool, five lumps of natural rubber, and ten goat hides. You seem to have this pretty well figured out for not having a supplier. Oof, that's probably going to take a while. Is that okay? Take your time. That'll give me a chance to set up shop and fill out forms and the like. Ah, yes, bureaucracy. Fishing tip four. All right, we found another fishing tip. Apparently, if I break boxes, I can find fishing tips. So I'm going to break some more boxes and read them all at once. Fishing tip five. I'm missing fishing tip two. I don't know where to find fishing tip two. All right, it's no big deal. I'm not going to let myself get bogged down. All right, tip four. You can use A to reel in a fish even if its HP is not completely depleted. The more HP it has, the less likely you'll land the fish. Okay, so I was kind of right by pressing the A button. You just can't do it right away. That's not, I mean, it's helpful, it's just, I'm gonna need a lot of practice. Fishing tip five, some fish can be used as bait to catch bigger fish. I'm sure I would have learned that, but thanks for telling me. All right, well, I couldn't find any more quests, so let's go back to Yona. <sighs> Gosh, if only I had a way to get home quicker. Oh, look at this, ain't that convenient. All right, let's go, bud. I am speed. Excuse me, coming through, don't mind me. Oh, that's a big boy. Hey, how you doing? Can I fight you while I'm riding the boar? I think I can, I just don't think I can do a lot of damage to him. He is slow though, maybe I can fight him hand to hand. Oh, well, I knocked myself off my boar, so that's not helpful. All right, you are gonna be a tough one. On the upside, you seem slow, so as long as I'm just like up on my guard, I think I should be fine. You're also facing the wrong way, which is totally fine for me. Good stuff. I just can I can just stay behind him, charge up my lance. I don't know if this is supposed to be the strategy for this guy, but it's the strategy I'm using. Oh, he smacked me hard and killed me. <clears throat> All right. Well. Yep. Oh, good. They were nice enough to dump me uh, right here when I left the town. So there's an auto save system. I don't have to go all the way back to my last save file. It's a question I hoped I would never need the answer to, but now I have my answer. Oh, hang on. There's a side path here. Hello. What's this up here? Oh, that's a spy. I don't like that. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. I don't like spiders. Go away. Go away, go away, go away. Can I do a finisher? I couldn't do a finisher. Oh, I do not like you. All right, what do you get? Giant spider silk? All right, that was gross. <clears throat> oh, no, there's spiders crawling all over the place. Literally. Can you get me through the gate? Haha, <laughs> you can't get... Oh, now they're all going to gather, though. As soon as I open this, there's going to be trouble. All right, here we go. <clears throat> No, no cutscene. Let me just fight. Well, everything got all dreary and gray. I don't care for that one bit. Am I going somewhere I'm not supposed to? Am I here too early? Uh, I'm sorry, what? No, 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 Get off. How do you, whoa, hello, hey, um, how do I get these guys off? Stop it. Stop spitting out little spiders. All right, I'm gonna die. If I can knock you on your back and do a finisher. No, it just spits out a bunch of little babies. Dang it. That's not the way to do that. All right, are we done? Jeez Louise, I did not care for that one bit. All right, I am taking my rewards. All right, so spiders, possibly much harder than shades, but we'll see. I should probably also heal before checking out this house, but you know what, I'm in a bit of a YOLO mood. Never mind, I can't do anything to the house. I think I'm here too early, and I'm okay with that. Is hunting with the Dark Lance overkill? 
Nah. Ouch, I'm gonna get killed by a deer. Alright. I am going to get killed by a deer. Jeez. Alright, we're good. Jeez. Alright, I really gotta work on my combat because I'm getting killed even by just some basic forest animals. Alright, we need to avoid this guy. I actually should have went with the boar. I should have brought my boar with me. I'm gonna run around him. I probably need to kill him at some point, but it's not gonna be right now. Oh, just keep moving, just keep moving, just keep moving. Do not let him hit me. Alright, I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Just get through the gate and everything will be fine. Alright, we're finally back in the safety of our own town. Alright. Whew. Hey old man, how's it going? Hey, you there. Have you seen my Max around? I don't know who that is. Max? Sorry, I don't know a Max. See, I don't know who that is. Max is my dog. Oh, it's a dog. He's missing since yesterday. Oh, I see. Um, any idea where he went? He usually likes to run around the northern plains. Most of the time, he just comes and goes, but I haven't seen him in over a day. You let your dog just run around the northern plains where there's all sorts of dangers that could kill him, not including, like, well, not limited to just the shades. I'll keep an eye out. If I find him, I'll make sure to bring him back. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Is something wrong? Oh, it's nothing. Just a little choked up about my dog is all. That didn't sound like a choked up sound. All right. That sounded like a I accidentally pooped my pants sound. <laughs> all right, I need to heal. Can I heal at my own house? Is that a thing I can do? Hey, are you Max? I'm guessing you're not Max. That would be way too easy of a quest. Although I do, I would appreciate an easy quest. All right, let's uh, turn this stuff into the bartender because we definitely can finish that quest. Or at least I think I can finish that quest. Oh, perfect. I'll make the medicine right now. Mixing. Since you've already been such a help, could you deliver this to my grandmother? She's at the fountain by the library. As long as it's the fountain in this village and not the other village, yes, I can do that. Okay, I'll get it to her as soon as I can. All right, so this other bar tenant or whatever needs you help. Devil and Popola sing. Well, I'm hearing Devla right now. Sure, Devla sings here all the time. Yeah, she's right there. I ain't talking about that. I'm talking about the two of them singing together. Oh, well, are they a force to be reckoned with? Uh, no, I've never seen that. They used to come here and sing all the time. Lately, they're so busy. Hey, I know. You ought to get them to come back and sing for us. I thought this was going to be like a, hey, have you ever seen Devla and Popola in the same room at the same time kind of thing, which would be really funny. <laughs> I think they're just the same person. All right, we'll accept your quest. Ballad of the Twins. I feel like that's a thing song from Nier Automata, maybe? I'm sure it's referenced. Anyway, hey, hi, Devla. Can I ask you a favor? You're asking me for a favor? Well, now I've heard everything. What's up? That is true. It's always you asking me for favors. I heard you and Popola used to sing at the tavern. I never got a chance to hear it, so... Wait, you want to hear us sing? <laughs> Popola's been swamped lately, so I haven't sung with her in forever. But hey... If she's up for it, I'm willing. All right, do you also have a quest on top of that? Hmm, what have we got today? Which job should I give you first? Oh, no. Oh, no. I am not doing fragile delivery, too. Let's do postman's request. I've got a job from the postman in Seafront. He needs your help with a personal matter. I wrote down the client's location on your map, so head over there to get the details. I don't want to go over there. Yeah, I know where the post office is. All right, there's a lot of quests going on. There's a lot of quests. I bought your tulip bulbs. Thanks. Here's the money. That was not worth it. Oh, I may now use my field. That might be worth it. I have a field? Examine the field next to Basilisk's house to plant any seeds in your possession. Over time, the seeds will grow into flowers, fruits, and vegetables that you can harvest. Oh. I've been picking up seeds and stuff, but I've never really questioned what I would be doing with them. You have more for me? Oh, I forgot. I was going to ask you to get some fertilizer as well. Oh, well, isn't that convenient after I just got back from running your errand for you? Next time you're in Seafront, can you pick up three bounty fertilizers for me? I guess. All right, well, we'll have to go back to Seafront at some point, I'm sure. Excuse me, but can you help me deliver a large serving tray to the town of Seafront? A serving tray? 
Oh no, that was Fragile Delivery 2. I accidentally picked that up. I'd be happy to. Oh, this is not gonna go well. Wonderful. Just take it to the tavern, okay? Oh, and make sure not to jump around or fall over or anything. It's a very fragile tray. I am going to immediately forget. All right, you know what? I'm gonna spare you, me, and everybody else the trouble right now. I am just gonna go and deliver this serving tray. I'm not even gonna show you. There's gonna be a big old jump cut right here. All right, I had some close calls, but I did manage to do it on my first try. Saving you, me, and everybody else all the trouble. All right, hey let's there. turn this in. Got a special delivery here with your name on it. Oh, thank you. This will make my life a lot easier. We should tell the client we delivered the package. All right, and as long as I'm here, I'm gonna go talk to the postman. All right, what seems to be the dealio, dude? Uh, just the kid I was looking for. What's up? I've got a letter for the lighthouse lady, and I was hoping you could deliver it. <sighs> the other postmen, well, they don't really want to deal with her. You don't say. You don't say. You don't say. I'd do it myself, but with my bad leg and all. Anyway, sorry to keep bugging you, but can you help? Sure thing. The lady hardly ever leaves that lighthouse, so you should start there. Oh, and thank you. Start there? It means we're gonna have to chase this old lady around, right? Nerve. How dare he boss us around? It's okay, Vice. At least we're helping people. Ah, you are far too soft. Hey, look, as and long as I am handsomely paid. Man. Book. I'm sure I won't be handsomely paid, but it'd be nice. I certainly won't get paid by doing nothing, so might as well do something. Hi, I've got another stupid letter for you. Oh, you again. Are you alright? You took so much time delivering the mail, my illness has gotten worse. I'm lucky I'm not dead. You truly are a staggering creature. Well, since you're here, I guess I should give you a little something. Alright, alright, thousand gold. That's more than I got from Tulip Lady. Whoa, I, I can't accept this much. <laughs> it's fine, just take it. Take it and go. Do not look a gift horse in the mouth. But bring the mail quicker next time, and I want to see a smile. Oh lord. If I thought service with a smile was gonna get me a higher pay, I'd do it. I don't think she's gonna pay me more than that. Alright, so I think the last thing I need to do is buy fertilizer, and then I'm just gonna go back and finally give stuff to Yona. Well, I'm gonna give the medicine to the old lady first, but then I'm gonna go give stuff to Yona. Except I'm not sure where somebody buys... Fertilizer. Oh, there's the fertilizer. Jeez, I went to every stall and couldn't find fertilizer. Turns out you have to buy it from the pharmacist for some reason. All right, now we're gonna go back and see Yona. All right, I got you your fertilizer. Thanks. Sorry to make you go all that way. Here's the money for the materials and a little extra for your trouble. And here, take a ball then a pack of fertilizer. You'll be amazed at how fast these things grow. What's the point of flowers in this game? The vegetables I might be able to see a purpose for, but flowers, are they just for selling? I got the achievement Village Handyman. You can't see it, but I got that. I'm guessing you get that for doing a certain number of quests. All right, I did your stupid quest. In one piece. Sorry, I know that must have been difficult. Hopefully some gold will help ease the pain. It was not worth it. All right, I'm gonna go give the old lady her medicine, and then I'm going to see Yona. Nobody is going to get between me and Yona after I give this old lady her medicine. Ma'am, I have something for you. Oh, what a nice young man. Now I can finally walk around without pain. What are you kids looking at? Don't work yourself too hard, ma'am. I won't, Sonny. And here, let me give you something for all your help. Don't spend it all in one place now. All right, 2,000 gold. I'll take 2,000 gold. All right, I'm coming, Yona. Your big brother's coming to help. Ooh, a field. No, I won't be distracted. I'm coming, Yona. Hey, Yona. How you doing? Uh, everything hurts. That's not the answer I wanted to hear. Hang in there, okay? I got you some medicine. It's not going to taste good, but I need you to take it anyway. It's a fish. Don't worry. I can handle it. That's what I like to hear. She's such a trooper. The next morning. Hey, look who's up and about. Good morning. Hey, how you feeling? Better. It doesn't hurt anymore. Yay. That's great. 
That's really great. Hey, what's that book? Oh, you're just now noticing the book. Oh, yeah. Guess I should introduce you. I am Grimoire Vice, wielder of Arcane. Oh, hi, Vicey. <laughs> now, see here. Leave it to the nine-year-old girl to come up with a nickname. <laughs> Vice has been worried about you, too. Really? Aw, thanks, Vicey. It appears impudence is the fruit of this family tree. Hey, you can say what you want to me, but you don't be rude to Yona. Anyway, I need to go talk to Popla. Stay here and get some rest, alright? Alright. Wait, do you have a quest for me? Hey, I was thinking about trying to make stew for you. Do we have any venison or wheat? I have venison. S stew? Uh, I don't want her to feel bad, but her cooking is... <laughs> <laughs> don't say a word. Alright, Yona. Let me see if I can track down your ingredients. Really? Thanks. I'm sure you're gonna love it. I'm sure I will. Alright, do I already have the ingredients? I do not. Okay. I definitely have venison, but I don't... I'm guessing I don't have any wheat. Uh, I mean, I could check. Yeah, I've got plenty of venison, but I don't have any wheat. However, I know that I have wheat seeds, and for a home I have a field. Meal. Is there something you want to say? Oh, no. No, no. Nothing at all. That's well, what I, I thought. I know not a four-star chef or anything, but she puts her heart into it. Only a real jerk wouldn't appreciate the effort. What kind of brother do you think I am? Did you hear me imply anything of the sort? I guess not. Just, well, good luck. Yeah. Four-star chef. Apparently Michelin stars are a thing in this universe. For anybody that doesn't know, four Michelin stars is like the most stars a chef can get. It's not a five-star system. I'm not sure why it's different. But anyway, now you know. Four stars is the best that a chef can get. Hey. Sorry to interrupt, but I have to correct myself here. After a quick Google, I discovered that the most Michelin stars that a chef or restaurant can get is three. However, there are other awards awarded by the Michelin Guide that can go up to five, such as the Fork and Spoon Award. Additionally, if a single location has more than one Michelin starred restaurant in it, then that location can total up all of the stars of its restaurants. So, for example, if a hotel has two one star restaurants and one three star restaurant, you can say that the hotel has five Michelin stars, which is cheating, but apparently it's allowed. Let's see, plant. And then we want to plant wheat. We have two, we're gonna plant it all. We, have, we actually might as well plant all this stuff. What's the worst that can happen, right? The amount of items you can harvest from your field depends on what on the fertilizer and water supply. Watering frequency only affects plants at each stage of growth. So try watering a little bit over a long period of time. Interesting. I'm not gonna worry about fertilizer off the bat, but at some point in this game, we might just start playing. <laughs> we'll start playing Harvest Moon or Rune Factory or Stardew Valley, take your pick. All right, we'll plant our other wheat. I should really get a gardening outfit. All right, what else do we want to plant? Bell peppers, I'm just gonna plant everything I can. I'll be right back. All right, everything has been planted and watered, which took a while because you have to do a little animation for every tiny little thing, but that's actually all the time that I have for this episode. So we'll go and see Popola next time. Thank you everybody so much for watching. I certainly appreciate it. Make sure if you like this video, you leave a like on the video. If you like this video, think about giving the channel a subscribe because there's lots of other stuff on the channel and I'll keep making videos for various things, upload Twitch streams, all that stuff. Um, so, you know, a subscription would be nice, but you can do what you want. Thanks again, and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye-bye!